Hi, this is Christy Marie Gott. I'm going to show you how to use the Customize tab for WordPress Theme 2012. Go to your dashboard and you'll see a drop-down selection for themes. You can also go to Appearance, Themes. And when you're in the Themes screen, you'll see under 2012 the link for Customize, Widgets, Menus, Header, Background. And of course you have those choices down the left in the dashboard menu as well. Let's click on Customize. That'll open a convenient tab that you can use. This is where you can choose to customize your site title and tagline, the colors, the header image, the background image, the navigation, custom menus, and whether to have a static front page. That means that the front page is a home page that doesn't change when you upload new material. You can still have your blog pages on the other pages. And so under site title and tagline, you can click, type your site title in, and your tagline. And here's where you can put a check mark to display the header text. I chose not to because I've got my logo and my header text right here in the image header. Now under colors, this is where you can choose a background color for your website. Uh, a lot of people these days are keeping the background uh, white so that it's easy to read, easy to see on a smartphone, easy for any size screen, whether it's small or large. Here's where you would customize your header image and you would click here to upload an image. The background image is, this is where you can upload a background image. Um, here's navigation and this is where you choose if you have some custom menus and you want to choose one of those. Uh, I've got a custom menu up here and I'll explain how to make those in another video. And here's where you customize your static front page. Click to put your latest posts if you want to have a most recent post on your static page, or rather on the front of your website. If you want to have a blog post type site, you would click here. If you want a static page site, you'd put a dot in that radio button. And then for front page, you would click this down arrow and you can select a page from your formatted pages to use as that static front page. And uh, this is for, for a post page. You can make a selection. When you're done, you would click Save. I'm going to close out of that. And of course, you have menus, header, background, and so on available over here too. But this is a handy customized tab it makes it easy and convenient to customize 2012. Thanks for joining me for this video. Happy computing and have a great day.